Well, the kid's uh, tree guard seems to have woken up. I haven't done anything. He just woke up. Now, we seem to have a fairly good-sized clear area. I'm tempted to see if we can go ahead and bump him off. And I have an overwhelming desire to have this tree here that the kid planted. However, what worked before was burning him out here, the other one out here. Supposedly, the uh, beefalo don't respawn. So, I don't especially want to accidentally kill one of those in fire. My gracious. He seems to be very awake this time. I wonder if he's going to go to sleep or not. There we go. I don't know if the other one was this big. It doesn't seem like he was. I would like to get this done before nightfall. I didn't do it good. Yeah, there it goes. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. That will be fine. Now, I saw something where it called for burning one of them seven times. And I don't see him standing up and being active. Well, we're going to have to uh, get back to this. What I was thinking about was doing was a bunch more exploring because evidently we haven't explored near as much of the world. I thought there wasn't that much more world after the uh, swamp over there and evidently there's just a ton of world over there after the swamp. Better get my ass back up here before it becomes a problem. He said as he ran the wrong way. I also got a note from the kid that said uh, he'd got a hundred and he uh, got a hundred and thirty no three hundred and sixty uh, science points from cooking off rope because I mentioned him the idea of uh, that I saw posted in forums of. Uh, cooking off torches, uh, making torches for science points. And I haven't forgotten our wooden friend down there. I'm going to go burn him some more. Dealing with our tree friend here is kind of a high priority. Alright, this is twice, three times, I guess, if you count that. Four times. There he goes. Well, bye, tree guy. I didn't see him turn into meat, etc. Ah, famous last words. I did see him turn into meat. There's a ton of stuff here to be harvested and have things done to it. Now, what uh, I saw in forums, you can put that cooked meat, go ahead and use it in uh, the crock pot, whether it's cooked or not. I'm hearing the oddest noise. Oh, I bet you it's the bird trap. 
Yep. And it's another damn red bird. But I'm probably going to take some time and, and clear all these chests out. Get this organized in a halfway sane way. Food, food, food. I hear buggies. the guggies I hear. Hi, guggies. Let's go play with the beefaloes. I was kind of thinking about fighting them. Can't fight them all together. I guess I'll let the beefaloes kill them. Probably was no, not a surprise to anybody. Oh, that's right. I'm not carrying my stuff. Did we use up one of our helmets? No, we didn't even use up a helmet. Huh. Well, I wonder what's in our little trap. Meat. But I don't think it was from a bunny. We're still just uh, doing chores. I'd still like to have a fire break out here. Alright, that was a crow. We got another feather. That was all food. Okay, we made, with the frog legs and the meat morsels, we made a froggy bun witch. And we're at 36. And we probably wasted some there. We went to a full 100. Alright, I'm kind of thinking about this bee mine thing. Okay, where would we put mechanized bees? I don't want them so close it becomes a problem. And I don't even know what it is we're building. Oh! Mine as in explosive device that kills things. Oh! So you run your enemies through that. Okay, I understand, said the blind man. Okay, so I don't actually necessarily need that. Put bees under weapons. Alright, what I'm thinking about doing is using the kid's idea to uh, pound some science. Just making ropes and pounding science by that means. I think we need some manure to uh, fertilize our berry bushes too if we want them. We could theoretically go get some... Uh... Oh, I'll bet that damn turkey... Uh munched up all the berries. They warn that if you don't do something about it, they'll uh, munch all the berries off your tree, off your bushes. And with that update in five days, it may not be the smartest thing to be doing. Well, it depends. I can play a lot in five days, so that's not a big issue. But I don't remember exactly he did, I think, 360 science points, however much rope that is. 
but I mentioned to him the thing of using torches because you don't use uh, tools, and of course he went me one better on that, but we're at 172, I think these are worth 27, yeah. But you can just plug grass with no tools so you're not using up flint or gold, either one. Like I was using uh, boards, which use up axes. But he just pounded science through ropes for a day, I guess a day and a night. And then I guess he had a little bit of a hellhound problem. Okay, we're up to 523. Feather. Oh, that's what I need the spotty stuff for. And the actually redbird. Because I was going to stop gathering the red redbird feathers, but it seemed to me that, you know, eventually everything has a use. So I was trying to think where the. Uh, like, kid, I can't find the damn tent either. Was it under survival? Alright, it's 200. Now it's, whoa, 15 spider webs. Damn! Okay, we might as well make use of the daytime. We could make that thing at night. Well, we could probably read that thing anywhere. That was survival, right? The Wiggy Womb. 15, so... Now, I don't know if I had fraps on or not when I looked at that mine thing for weapons, but it's like a blowy up mine. It's a little spiky thing like the old uh, mines they used to put in the water for ships. And evidently you run your enemies across it. Which is kind of a mixed bag. I don't know if anybody, if it'd be best to carry one and try to drop it on the fly. I'm not very good with the controls for dropping something while I'm running. I guess I could learn to be. Now, I haven't had fraps on because I've just been gathering and doing science and stuff like that, so you haven't really missed anything. We go adventuring, or if I get hellhounds or whatever, I'll uh, make sure that's a video, but there's no point of video watching me do this stuff. He said as he made video watching him do this stuff. Okay, where do we want this? I was thinking right here, but I want to dig the rest of the... I was thinking there. Okay. About wipes us out on uh, spider webs. Let's put that in with weapons. It's not exactly a weapon, but what the hell. Alright, that's another crow fella. Yeah, these things don't wear out or anything just sitting down there, so what the hell. I guess I could have done that a long time ago, just pounded all the research on all the items. Alright, what I was thinking about doing was using this uh, tent here. Oh, all this opened up. I guess I can't open him until I die. I don't know what happens if you die as windy. I don't know. I don't feel like doing her in the... Uh... Okay. Now I can look at more science to open at nighttime. 